What's striped like a zebra, glides like silk, and stings like regret. Meet the lionfish, a mesmerizing, underwater paradox wrapped in venom-tipped beauty. These exotic predators boast feathery spines and hypnotic stripes, looking more like a tropical daydream than a marine threat. Native to the Indo-Pacific, lionfish can live up to 15 years with over 15 known species. Each one wears its own distinct blend of stripes, spots and flamboyant fin fans, making them look more like flamboyant art projects than apex predators. But don't be fooled by the frills. Lionfish are equipped with 18 venomous spines that can cause excruciating pain, swelling and nausea in humans. They don't hunt with brute force. They stalk and trap prey using stealth and patience, then vacuum them up in a blink. It's not brute strength, it's calculated slow motion devastation. Here's where it gets messy. These fish have invaded the Caribbean and Western Atlantic, and when we say invaded, we mean population explosion. Released by aquarium owners and with no natural predators in these non-native waters, lionfish devour native species and disrupt fragile reef ecosystems. A single lionfish can reduce native juvenile fish populations by up to 90% in a matter of weeks. That's not overfishing, that's underwater annihilation. Worse yet, female lionfish can release up to 2 million eggs per year and those eggs drift for miles on ocean currents. It's not just a population, it's an aquatic empire on the move. But nature hasn't completely given up. Some sharks and groupers are beginning to give lionfish a taste test, while divers have organized lionfish derbies to help remove them from coral reefs. Turns out, they're edible, delicious even. One invasive species turned sustainable seafood? That's a plot twist nobody saw coming. In the end, the lionfish is a walking contradiction. Beautiful yet deadly, exotic yet destructive. It's nature's reminder that even the most stunning creatures can wreak havoc. And sometimes the villains wear the best patterns.